Hello LEGO fans, hello LEGO minifigure fans. I decided to take a shot at some LEGO customization and not so much I'm not painting or printing or anything like that unfortunately. Um, I don't have that kind of technology or know-how uh, but just combining some different minifigure parts to turn around and make something a little different. So I really wanted to do Starkiller. Um, Sam Witwer's uh, character from the video game Force Unleashed. They did come out with a character. He's also known as Darth Vader's Apprentice or the Secret Apprentice. Um, but this is the dark Sith version of uh, of the Apprentice or Starkiller. Um, I might go with a different torso. This is actually Catwoman's or so from one of the sets and uh, if you look very very close you'll see a little bit of suggestive curvature um, but um, you have to really really look close in order to see that so I mean me I, I just wanted something with some uh, multiple colors in it something that looked kind of decent I went with legs with a little bit of a printing right here on the legs just so that way they weren't completely plain um, I gave him two lightsabers, one he's got held forward, one he's got held back. Uh, I gave him a black cape, and I know in the first game he was more or less uh, had like a um, buzzed hairstyle, but Sam Witwer, the, um, the guy that does the voice acting for him, he's kind of got like a messy dark colored hair usually when he's doing interviews and stuff, and I wanted something that resembled Sam Witwer a little bit. As far as the hair goes, I think it really looks cool. And I gave him um, Kylo Ren's face, actually, because that was one of the best angry faces that I could find in a standard skin uh, tone color. I also gave him the um, ripped arm out of his outfit like he uh, had at one point in the game. Uh, so I basically, to resemble that, I turned on gave him a plain skin tone colored uh, arm and hand and a little bit of foreshadowing for both Darth Vader and um, Luke Skywalker I gave him the um, gloved black hand on the other arm there so I think personally I really like this character hold on um, or this interpretation of him I might um, down the road find a better torso for him um, I did find like a Sith trooper um, that had like a like a little red square on the black chest plate for the torso. I might replace it with that torso. I think that would be pretty cool. I also do have a black hood piece from an extra Luke Skywalker that I have that you could potentially replace his hair with the hood. Um, but yeah, let me know what you think down in the comments. I think he turned out pretty freaking nicely. Um, I'm really excited to add uh, Star Killer in with my collection because uh, I loved both games, and me personally, I just did not like the actual Star Killer that they brought out eons ago. But I think this one looks really cool. I might uh, try my hand at doing a light version of Star Killer as well. Let me know what you think uh, down in the comments. Um, I think he turned out pretty good for the most part, you know, other than the torso being a little suspect if you look a little too close, but I think he looks a lot better than the original. Well, that's it. I don't want to keep rambling on about, uh, about him, but, uh, yeah. So, and there he is, and he will be going into my collection. This is my custom, uh, Star Killer, and I will probably be doing a light version of Star Killer. Of course, he will not. He would be known as Gareth, not Star Killer. And I will probably also do a custom of Juno, just because I liked her character in the first game. So that being said, who knows? Maybe I'll get some of the pieces to uh, build the actual ship down the road, and because uh, I can get that screen, and the rest of them are pretty basic uh, um, pieces. So. You know, some are a little harder to get, but uh, yeah, I think it's doable. So, at any rate, please leave a like and a 
description if you like this video and uh, hit that bell for future notifications on future uh, videos as well. And uh, I will catch you in the next video. Thank you so much. This is Bricks on a Budget, Tanya. Get built. Thanks, guys. Bye.